Welcome to Sirinton Stadium. We're here tonight for the game between Chambury and Chula United. I'm going to give you a brief tour, starting outside the, one of the entrances here, gate number two. Uh, obviously, you've got a few, the Red Bull stall over to my left over there, part of one, one of the commercial partners of the club. Behind you, over that side, is part of the Assumption College uh, where the ground is situated. It's quite a large campus. It's going to be our last season here. In fact, it's our penultimate game. There's only one more after this. It'd be quite sad to leave because uh, Sirinton, Assumption and Chambury have got a long history together. But we've onwards and upwards moved to our new stadium back in the city of Chambury. So if you want to follow me, I'll take you through the gate. got my ticket ready. So we'll just walk through. It, nice and straightforward. Okay, just inside the main gate here, we've got the merchandise stalls. Obviously doing a brisk trade. Uh, we were one of the, if not the first club, to actually get the merchandise in off the ground. Uh, the old municipal stadium in Chambury, we had a similar setup, uh, but obviously now there's a, a much greater demand than there was back then. Um, and usually on match days, there's quite a queue forms around these about an hour, a good hour before kickoff, and obviously throughout the game as well and afterwards, especially if we win. So if you'd like to come with me. These are obviously the, the team shirts here, people having the names and numbers printed on the back of the shirts. Uh, we've now got two machines, we used to only have one. That's a sign of progress, I think. A bit further along, there's quite a few more items here. Quite a wide range. Chambury clocks, uh, teddy bears, hats, footballs, all sorts. A bit of nice friendly staff, obviously, there, giving us a big wave. Um, so it's difficult to get too close because of all the people. And now they've gone shy. They're not usually this shy. And then again, we've got more, more merchandise here, a range of stationery and the very, very popular fans. Uh, it's, not, it's not actually that warm today, but on a hot day, the fans do come in very useful. And we move along here to the, um, this is the fan club merchandise stall, run by some very long standing members of the Chambry fan club. Um, I've known these people six seven years uh, right back in the beginning um, and they've been they've done a fantastic job they're also responsible for recruiting uh, fan club members and if we go around here we can perhaps have a quick chat with Kun A who's the fan club secretary nice new range of shirts I might get one of these later it's quite smart here we've got Kun A going about her business Working very hard as you can. I just have a quick word, please. The Chambury Fan Club. How many members do we have now? Uh, around one. The last number is two hundred eighty. Two thousand. Yes. Yes. Okay. Two thousand eight hundred seventy-one. That's that's just been issued. That card. About just as we came. Um, I've got a card somewhere in my wallet. I'm number fifty-five. I can remember that and. New is number 54, but she lost a card. <laughs> That's it. Um, would you like to tell us a little bit about this here? Hey. Uh, last man, last man. We found some, something in, in, the, in the match at the Mueang Thong Stadium. But Shumri FC fan uh, told, told the bottle in the in the uh, yes and but but uh, Mung Thong Mung Thong also Mung Thong have a yes yes to the stadium but only Shomri FC only Shomri FC pay for this uh, this the, yeah, yeah yeah but it's Mung, not fair, is it? yeah yeah not fair for <laughs> not, not fair for us yes but Meng Hong didn't. Yes. Why? Why? Only only Chomri FC fan pay only. 
So we're having a collection here to raise money to pay 50, and I'm, I'm sure that will get quite a lot of people contributing. Thank you very much. Okay, if you'd like to come this way. Um, this is the, the main stand over here. Uh, when I first started coming to watch games here, um, there'd be very, very few people in the ground. Uh, we used to sit over there, which is now the, the VIP enclosure. Uh, obviously, you've got the two dugouts and the players' tunnel. And up at the top there, you have the, the television gantry and a few more VIPs sitting around there, obviously visiting dignitaries, uh, opposition officials and all the rest of it. Uh, I usually sit over here in this section. This has been my sort of home, really. Uh, in fact, my wife's somewhere in that crowd, hopefully. Oh, there she is. I can see her. Uh, and obviously it gets, gets quite lively down here during the game. But it's a great place. You get a good view. And you, you are quite close to the action, even though obviously there's a, a running track that goes around the ground. Um, over on the other side, that seems to be where the, the main sort of core of fans congregate. Um, I did used to stand over there, but it just got a bit too loud because I'm getting old now and I couldn't really cope with the, the numbers and the noise, so I moved to a bit of a quieter area across here. Um, pitch itself, I don't know if we can just have a quick look at the pitch. Obviously, we've, we've had quite a lot of rain over the past few days and the teams are coming out. We'll just have a quick look at the pitch as they come out. Um, we've had quite a lot of rain, so the pitch is, is very, very wet. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but there's some very dark patches, obviously, where the water's gathered. Um, there's a game here on Sunday, Sir Chara against BC Terro, uh, Saturday, sorry, and it cut up rather badly, so I'm expecting the same today. be quite heavy going, and, and the grass seems fairly long as well, so I think the players are, are in for a bit of a tough time, really, out on that surface. Um, and you can see behind me now, two teams are coming out. The, TPL or FIFA Anthem is playing. Um, obviously, we're in a midweek kickoff. There are fewer people in the ground than there'd normally be at this time. Um, but you'll notice it'll fill up as, as the game progresses. And here come the two teams. So, 